Hey everybody, Ola aka Chuck1 here with a Minecraft video. Gasp. Yes, but I've been trying to install a couple of mods. Now I don't play Minecraft that much, okay that's a lie, but I don't get into the mods very much. So this is my first experience with mods and the reason I'm doing this video is because I had a hell of a time trying to get these installed. Turns out it's actually really simple but the problem is there were old instructions, wrong instructions that probably apply to previous versions of Minecraft so I figured you know what, this is the instructions right here, the steps to follow to get Minecraft Forge installed and the minimap, Ray's minimap, as well as the backpack mod. Those are the three things that I wanted to accomplish. And this is how I did it. There will be download links in the description below. I've already downloaded these three files and I've put them in this folder here. And I have a brand new clean installation of Minecraft where all I've done is logged in and created a single player world so I can show you. First thing that you want to do to get there is if you hit the start button and then type in percent app data. This will open up your app data folder. You'll see right at the top the dot minecraft folder. This is where you want to go into. You don't actually have to do anything with this. A lot of the instructions were oh go in here and do stuff and open up jar files and all that. Nope. Don't need to do that. We'll put this aside for the moment and stick it over there. Now my folder here where I have things downloaded. I'm gonna start with the Minecraft Forge installer. It's a dot jar file. You don't think you can double click on it, but guess what? You double click on it. It already knows where it's going to go. That's the folder, so when you didn't mess with your Minecraft stuff, which you didn't. Click OK, goes through, done. Okay, so now when we launch Minecraft, you will notice that there is a new profile up here. You're going to want to choose that, the Forge profile. Log in with your username and password. This is just your Minecraft username and password. And uh, when you click play, it's going to do a couple things. It's going to actually add some files to your .minecraft folder, which you don't care about. It's just going to launch the game, and you're going to notice right here, it tells you that Minecraft Forge is loaded. It also lists some of the default mods. These just come with that. That's it. That's all that you need to do for this. By itself, doesn't do anything. You can quit out of there. Now the question to actually get these two mods, the minimap and the backpack, installed. Again, it couldn't be any simpler. You copy both the zip files. You don't even extract them. You just take the zip files as they are and you paste them into the mods folder underneath the .minecraft folder. You paste them there, load the launcher again, log into your forge profile, and with a little bit of luck and no magic at all, once you get into the game, it should now tell you that, oh, look at that, five mods are loaded, five are active. If you look at the list, there's the minimap, there's the backpack, done. Load into your single player or multiplayer game, and in a second, we should see a minimap. And the top, oh my god, look at that, it worked. It's a minimap. I'm not going to show you how to actually make the backpacks. They explain it on the website. You just have to get some leather and craft it into a variety of backpacks. That's it. That's all there was to it, and I literally spent the last two hours, and I was just about ready to give up. So hopefully this helped you out, and I'm not going to go punch this sheep.